Hi, today I'm going to show you how to do some basic latte art at home. First thing you want to do is start with a fresh espresso and cold milk, ideally from a cold milk jug. That just gives you a little bit of extra time when you're steaming to produce, <laughs> to produce a nice creamy texture. So we're going to start with the milk wand right at the top of the milk jug until it reaches about 35 degrees. Now 35 degrees, if you don't have a thermometer, is, uh, is easily judged by uh, holding the jug. And when, when that reaches body temperature, you know you're at 35 degrees. And when you reach that point, I want you to drop the jug. I want you to raise the jug, which drops the milk wand, milk steaming wand, right to the bottom of that jug for you. And we're going to continue steaming until the milk reaches 65 degrees. Now 65 degrees is the ideal temperature for uh, for your milk-based coffees like piccolo, latte, flat white, cappuccino. We just clean that steam wand afterwards. So take your fresh espresso base, tilt the cup just a little bit, and if you have any bubbles in your milk, just give it a tap or two, those bubbles will disappear. So after swirling it a second, um, we wanna pour from a little bit of a height into the cup to break through that crema and then start with your design. So that's a very basic, um, not a very good version of, but that's a very basic way to do latte art. So we're starting up high to punch through the crema and then down low to paint. So when I say paint, that's the, the white part of the milk. Um, as an example, if I was quite low, you can see the milk is gonna sit on top and it's gonna paint the milk. From a height, it will go straight through. So that's, uh, that's how we do latte art at home. Um, I prefer to use full cream milk if possible. Um, full cream milk does have a little bit more fat in it and um, uh, allows the milk to texture um, a lot better than, than light milk will. Um, today I've used light milk. Um, see how you go, give it, some, uh, give it some time, some practice, and let me know what you think.